Jamu kubera ona te. Mukama katondo chadira makago ila we gurunize makago. Mwenye wanda liba debya mfuna. Mukama ugonjole ebya mfuna ebyo. Mwenye chinonga adinesonge ya mazima. Mwenye zoku baba debana baba debata mangu se. Nurembele ne yechibi. Yesu uli lukusama kwa abu lichinomu. Na lichinomu wako kwa wana. Kili zae chitafi. Mwenye kuride. Mwenye kukora kwa abu lichinomu. Ali wano yuna kumuduru alio. Bele wa mungabi jizi wa fe. Bele vyo vyo. Baga lukwani za mungi ni njavulo. Ali. Omusumba. Yolo juhuzo nsekako. Mwanchua kumkulu wabla jizi wa fe. Uya walida niyona lebo Sebo tuwe aziza Lulete kateke fana na weti Nemu ngele nja ulo Nzema nita wakadewe wakani samuli mandu wakulu Mwote kateke kasi ndo Teka wakani ka mwe Ndo za tunatso wote kuwe ya wani Uwe soge njagalo kuwe basabu ni mkate wondi na wondi Uwe uwe nezo uwe nja ulo Kubanga kaniseno miliku mwibega mwibega ya mwe Lweto njaka lukwe waza Sinaba jeso wana nanti yoke dama njaka mwena yesi Ili kisomoste Ewe mkiri zoku ita ku Muzina luku nonge waze Ulo uwe za uwe mkola Jemui Ila mkama Mwaka kuno Atonge la mani Kongere Kukuisitu la kaniseno
Now the soldiers came. They had their guns on their shoulders. If you have ever seen soldiers, they are tough people. They don't laugh. Because when you laugh, the robber may go away. That's it. Now you must be determined that you are a lion. When they came towards us, then my heart was happy. Because I did have spot with me. I started preparing my mind. What could be the response if they ask me? Then they came towards me. They peeped in the car. And they saw a man who was sitting at the city. To my surprise, they stepped backwards three times. And they saluted. I was surprised asking, What is happening here? I was prepared to answer questions, but now they are saluting me. Then they opened and we went through. Then I said, Oh, this day. Then I asked the daughter of the elder, what is happening here? Because in that case, it seemed as if it was only me trembling. Then the girl smiled. And she told me, you know what? That I got on president's office. My father works in the president's office. So Broto gave her. Now the Broto says, we want to her. If they gaze at him, they have to salute. There is a gentleman I want to tell you. You've gone through a lot of things in 2020. You have gone through a lot of things in 2020. Not because of your power. But because Jesus drives the car in which you are. That's why the world salutes to you. Because Jesus has been with you. Ladies and gentlemen, that's why it is very important to thank God. Because whatever we've gone through, it has been much. And some of you are still going through a road. But I'm here to inform you yes, that our Lord Jesus is here. He is seated on the throne and he rings. The angels honor him. The world will worship him because he is the Lord. He is the King of Kings. He is the Alpha and Omega. He holds the keys to the head. He is the everlasting life. We are in the right place, ladies and gentlemen. Let's say big amen to the Lord. The psalmist says, Psalm 94. Verse 17. Bible David says, If the Lord was not my guide, my soul would have ceased to live. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to, as we begin to worship today, I want you to guess and imagine. Imagine whatever the Lord has taken us through. Let me remind you. We started 2022 after COVID 19 lockdown for three years. And everyone was saying, No, thank you. Life is going to start again. People had a lot of programs. 
Some people with money, they had a lot of programs, but some of us, we didn't have anything. In the first month, uh, on the 23rd day, we got a news that the governor of the Bank of Uganda, Aumude, he sees us to leave. Ladies and gentlemen, the governor that you're talking about, I now saw Okufuna He has all access to all medications. They tell us that the disease that led to his death was sukari. It is uh, diabetes. How many of you are having diabetes? But the Lord has spared you for his glory. And you have nothing like any money. And some of us, we don't even know whether we are sick. The Lord has just kept us alive. Now in February, in the second month, we got in more news that the lead of the Senate, the right honorable speaker, the right honorable speaker, that he was also sick. And the country did whatever possible to save the life of this man so that he may serve this country. And we even Got an airplane. The news says that we used 1.7 billion to save the life of this gentleman. But he rested. How many of you are having a billion in accounts? Ladies and gentlemen, Simon Yagamba, Solomon said, Send the Zitamuyona that money answers all questions. But these ones, the Zasobola, it never saved them. Now, according to World Health Organization, Alan to Amakumi Atano Atano. 55 percent of people died of Ebola last year. Why this disease never started from where? If I told you that I started here in Bugema, I think I would be among the 55 people who died. But the Lord is great. That's why we praise his name. I'm still taking you back in imagination. World Health Organization says, Among 10,000 people in Uganda, Two hundred and fifty-three people are having uh, TB. You might have met one with it yesterday, rather, last week. Why not you? We get this very week. Accident in Gul. Fifteen people died instantly. Report to the police Zikamba. The police report says that every year nine thousand people die in accidents. But you still alive. Jesus batting in the where is Western Uganda. Recently when I was going to serve in Western Uganda. As I was going, prepared myself and read it. 
The news at night say there has been an accident. Masaka Lord. Alongside Masaka Lord. Then my wife said, May the Lord lead you. As I was seated in the car, whenever the car is speeded up, I could say now. And in coming on, as I could say, God, you have saved us. I went south and back in a life. Why don't we thank God for the great things He has taken us through? Now let me tell you even this. Report the report of Uganda National Revenue Authority. As they try to work with uh, the uh, NGOs, they say. That all the businesses that were set five years ago, 55 of those businesses they closed. It means people have lost their jobs. Now, if you still have your job, thank God. And they say that even the business at work, they are crippling. Now we are entering 2023. And the business, what you call even your business, you are not sure whether it will close next month. I am here today, ladies and gentlemen, to tell you that even if it looks like that, I am God, oh my soul, and everything in me. Thank his holy name. the goodness of the Lord. As for you, he forgives. All your evil doings. Now let me tell you something. He groans you with care in his tender masses. He fills your mouth with his goodness. So that your usefulness may be like an ego. Ladies and gentlemen, it is worth it.
That's not my sin. My focus in this story is this young man. His father has eight sons. The story of them is so amazing. That even when Sunday came to anoint him, he would die. David was forgotten. I still forget your soul. Let me tell the truth. Sometimes I go to preach, they look for a preacher, and they cannot see. Yet I am there. And one day there was a time somebody asked me, Who is the preacher? Oh, wow. Then I said, The preacher of where? She was like, I'm told that the preacher, his name is Peter I don't know you. Never again, Then I was like, I'm going to see you. When the second hand is a camel, to get him. And they asked him, have you seen Elisha? He said, yes, I have seen Elisha. And this kid one was look, uh, searching for a preacher, but he couldn't. But because I'm used to that, wherever I go, they cannot see me. They will see me after the, the sermon and they say, ah, that is the pastor. Let me tell you when the Lord is doing great works in you, people will overlook you because their eyes can only see out wide. The Lord told Samuel that I don't see like you. For me, I am looking at the inside of a person. I'm looking for a man with a heart. As they were heading to this battle, because David was still young, in the family of Jesus, they got an only three. Mighty men. And if you read in the Bible, please understand that these women in chapter number 16, it is only their names that are written and portrayed. Presents them, they were mighty men, and the the Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible the Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible says, the 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 it's as if the battle will last for long. Let me try to cut short, ladies and gentlemen. Because the Bible tells us you woke up early in the morning. I'm so excited to see you. As if his hands were, were itching him. He never slept to well asking, Where am I going? And he came very early. The Bible says that when he reached the camp, he heard the sound of Goliath. I didn't call him Nuni Daude. David has a good research. He made research. He asked, Who is that man? That guy has silenced us for 40 days. He only requested for one thing to that we should get a brave, a brave man from this side to go and battle with him. He said, Now, what's the problem there? Why don't you go there? 
come there and have a You are like, you know, young man. That is the way of young people. I want to come there and let you show that I come by young man. Have you ever been in the way and you bring a light and you have a young man? Young man. 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 Daudi naga pamuli mba. David said no it's not. Awacha yungela what? As he was talking. Mugaganda wena mulaba. His brother saw him. Uru. The elder brother. Nana maganaka sadya sika wadia kakoma mafuta kakoma. He was like, is this the anointed? Kaze wanu. He is also here. Kwe kujana mugamba David. He rushed and met him. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing here? Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to put your focus on this that David is being looked at in a different way. When he swapped down on verse number 28, we are at what David is told. David Muganda we have money, Boston, Boston, and yet, and we have yet, and many are so black, and many are in that, and many are in the black, and many are in the black, and many are in the black. His brother, who knows him since his childhood, who knows his capacity, capability, is asking him, who did they have the unity of Gamba? Now, listen to the Bible. Bible says, Gamba. Aweri ya Muganda we mkuru, na ulide di Gamba, da ulide ya yongela, na basaja. 28. Verse 28. Now Eliab, his oldest brother, heard when he spoke to the men. The Bible says he asked him, why did you come down here? Kindly put the finger on this one. Hearken to the, to the, to the, to the question. And with whom have you left those few sheep? With whom have you left those few sheep? Now imagine the oldest brother is asking him, David, what are you all about? Ladies and gentlemen. Why are you waiting to be waking in the sun? There are some things you should look for. Go food, go to my baby, go to my son. After the news, if you are a pastor, then you will go and pray so hard. Because that prayer doesn't belong to you. It is a communication that you are weak. I'm not going to lie. The man tells you, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. To whom have you left the language? This is what he meant. That leave the battles for generals for generals. Go back to your ship. These are for great fighters. Have you seen the man? Do you think that we are foolish? David asks me, he is the one who talks to me. Is it there any reason? If he went to battle with him, I wouldn't be here. I would be taking care of my ship. From my hand, I was presented before the king. After his brother had weakened him with his words, the Bible tells us that so told David. Why <laughs> Just a boy. 
Daudi Uru Hagamba, Kawakanke, and Westfiange, one of the other, and I'm coming on Mulange, Kawakan Zima, and Zima, or one for a woman. Then David said to the king, Let me give you my great comforter, because when you have not been, the Lord has been building me. Zero Bruno Brigo Buton. It's true that I take care of the leadership as my brother said. But when we are there now, a lion comes. It grabs one of the youngest It runs with it. I myself am a little boy. I fall after it. If this is not a myth, <laughs> if it isn't a myth, it means that God is able to do everything. The Bible says, the Bible says, the Bible says, I run after it and I grab it from the car. Then it turns against me. Then I grab its spear. The little boy. This is the little boy. One. I grab it. David never said that I make it, I, 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 I scare it. The Bible says I heal it. Then I walk away with my leadership. As I am still amazed of that. Then I come. Then the prayer comes. Then the prayer comes. It takes one. Then, if I wrestle with the lion, then I run after it. Then I get it. Then I run after it. Then I get it. Then I run after it. Then I get 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 it. Then I Saul and Agam be the same. Oh, then Saul asked, "Is that your curriculum, Vita?" Agam is a little boy. This is amazing. But I will hear them. The Bible says, "On the sword, the Goliath, the Philistine Goliath, who am I to watch when he is not David?" Let me read for you. Let me read for you. Verse 42. We are going to check them. Back and forth, the Bible says, This suit we are maga maga nala batawudi. So the Philistine came and when he saw David, Nam nyoma, he undermined him. Wachi, kuhanga, because, Ngayari mulenzi, for he was only a boy. Yea mumiu, Rodi, Mamasu ngagam, Gema lunji, And good looking. We are going to check them. Ngayari mulenzi, the Bible tells us that he was handsome. You cannot go to battle when you still handsome. No, I will not. I will not. I will not. You go through all the struggles and you come back with the skin of Magembe. Oh no, no. When you go for army trainings. You cannot come out. But the Bible says when you look at the darling David, you could say, No, he cannot fight. Ladies and gentlemen, I am here to inform you as you ask it. That you brother may say you are still young. The Bible speed cannot help you to achieve and finish the work. Somebody may tell you, even the business you are yet to set. David, Bamu, and you 
Ngatebwe seka baka sauru Yega tiwa kawa sadja Abani ngaba nukaibu yegamba Bako watange mitego Lejomu sare nemvumulo Ngabaso wala bulunji Ogulasa ufusare Nukuvumula mainda Ngabako zesa omkono wadiyo Nukwa kono Yang sadja manuwani wakuru Mulutalo luwani wa In the tournament the Bible gives us a picture of these men That were working with David They could store with their right hands and left hands without missing. Ladies and gentlemen, David, David, even though he was just a little bit, the Lord had blessed him and gifted him that when he could put his stone in the sling and he pulls and he pulls and you tire put your head up front as he could he would the right you are also down Bible gamba the the Bible says that David attacks the man, and when the man hears that David, he said, Do you think I am a dog that you should come with your sticks? David says, He comes to the sword. We have a lot of tools to fight. But I come to you without a sword. So that you may not grant the victory to the stone and the praises. The Bible says, when he is that David, he put off his helmet. When I stop this young boy, this young boy will come to understand if this young boy believes in the God who raises the dead maybe he will resurrect on the other day but this young boy today now let me take a little time to speak about this why do you think we slightly that in Israel there was no one who came out now let me just suggest this battle was prepared that he who comes he is not coming for his own he comes for the nation let me emphasize this I got to represent Uganda on the general conference. And I cannot sleep. Whenever you wake up, just say, Oh God, if at all. And I'm going to be able to do that. If they call me again, I can say, I'm sick, I cannot go. So much in the second level. Many people, even some of us seated here, when God gives us responsibility, we do not accept because we fear to carry the responsibility. Let me tell you, when the bishop called me, and he told me that I would be the one preaching, I 
I was one of the Israelites. I said, you know, I had a true and just reason. I told the bishop, I read a bridge in Luganda. I was in Luganda. I don't understand Luganda. Because when you follow my sermons, they are in English. The Lord was with him. He never wrestled with him. He said, No problem, we shall get the cup. Then I put in another reason. You know I am to be said this day. There is a, a certain meeting I'm going for. It's uh, for young Adventist professionals. You know this voice. It will be tired. I will be tired. Then the servant of the Lord said, when you come back, Galumu, that first Noah, or Kumana Ramun, Master, our meeting will be on eighth. He wrote a book about that. He was a good one. Granted, you be so nice. Then I looked at one. Then I was doing a little bit of a job. I said, even then, they will get me that maybe I'm not worth it. I waited for that phone call. We are changed. We have changed. We have got a preacher. The mighty one. When he preaches, people get baptized. When he preaches, even the stamps, they shake. I never came. I never received the call. As I was still there. He said, Pastor, why the hell do you see if you preach in Uganda? Then I said, yes. Yeah, she has brought it back. Then I said, now we are going to get a little bit. As I was going to sleep, and I was going to sleep, Still going through the message, it was the number. The voice told me, That's why I gave you that message because it's you who deserves to reach that message. Now, I want you to prove to people that it's you who in Uganda. Now, I've done it. If you are not contented, I've done what I If you are not to do anything, you are not here to do I'm here to tell you that in our Lord, everything is possible. I am here to tell you that in our Lord, you hear the voice of the Lord say, yes, I say, that don't ask questions. Just get your sleep. Please march forward. David. David. Let me put it in this. The Lord cannot bring lions in your life. Before him bringing a lion in your life. When you came back where he has told you from, you may understand that he has taken you over through many things. Get out of this place with an assurance that you have done everything in the Lord. David, David, he got his sling and he prepared it. He did not even know it. We don't know what he wrote. We don't know what he wrote. We don't know what he wrote. Uh, in the old days, I could preach and say that even the angels were there talking. But when I read this verse again, I was that the Lord had prepared David. But when he puts something, he cannot do this.
Amen. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, this kind of a meeting, but the Lord answers the prayers. And the prayers that are sent from this place are listened to. One day, I went into a meeting, and it was not like this, but it was of a kind. The light came. And I told me, Kind of Because my husband doesn't look at me. Even my children seem Adventist. He's not an Adventist. But I want you to pray for him. So that he may look at me. So that he may take it. Just after a few days, she sent me a text. And I told her, I want us. I guessed her on Facebook and the lady was looking so beautiful now. I said, Lord, you answer prayers. You answer prayers of weak people like me. Then another lady came. I don't know why one came meeting. We were here in camp meeting. Nana Mamsumba. She said, Pastor, I need. I need the feelings. I want to see the number. I don't have a job. I am a teacher. I want to be given government. Then, secondly, how do you see me? Then I told her, you are so beautiful. She said, you know what? Even if you say so, I don't have any body like me. Then I told her, you are so beautiful. And I told her, you are so beautiful. I told her, you are so beautiful. I want to give them to the Lord. Because I cannot tell them. They have to tell them. Now I have to wait. Then I said, Here, this is the altar. The Lord has us prayed. We are going to pray to him. And we shall give them to Saba. As we pray. After praying, after I had forgotten about that lady. She had taken my number. On WhatsApp, I received the message, Pastor, teacher so and so. Teacher so 